Ivy, Kano, CVC News, Lagos. The Nigerian Army has launched a special security operation in the southeast, codenamed Exercise Golden Dawn 3. This is to ensure the safety of lives and property before, during, and after the Yuletide. Flagging off the operation in Oweri, the Imo State Capital, the General Officer Commanding 82 Division, Nigerian Army, Enugu, Major General Hassan Dada, said the military is determined to end the nefarious activities of secessionist group, fight kidnapping, combat oil bunkering, and other criminalities in the zone. TVC News Springs Uba reports. This is an ammo operation by the Nigerian Army to ensure a safe holiday. This launch is coming after the joint military in the southeast region relaxed Operation Udoka. The operation is coming to complement the efforts of other security agencies to improve internal security during this festive period. The GOC, while assuring the people of the Southeast of adequate security during the Christmas and New Year festivities, warned that his men were ready to deal with anyone that would want to test the might by engaging in any form of criminalities. The need for effective cooperation of sisters and sisters and other security agencies is expected to play a significant role during the conduct of this exercise. Why not leaving now the importance of civil military corporations as well as the roles of the media? Therefore, it is gratifying to know that as I go in on this design to curb insecurity within the Southeast region and assist to restore confidence in the heart of the good people of the Southeast thereby creating an enabling environment to pursue their legitimate businesses. For the governor of Imo State, who was represented by his deputy, Professor Placid Njoko, he described the oppression as timely, noting that his administration would continue to accord priority to protection of lives and property of law-abiding citizens. It is therefore imperative to set in motion different strategies to check rate the possible rise in criminal activities within the state and its environs, especially as the unified season ends. Since the adoption of office as governor of Imo State, I have given high priority attention to the security of lives and property of our people, as this is the essence of good governance and secure peaceful development. I therefore appreciate and recognize the enormous commitment and sacrifices of all our gallant security forces in the state in improving a secure and peaceful environment for the good people of Imo State. Prince of uh, TVC News. Well, Nigeria's Chief of Defense, Dr.